Pokemon Red and uh, fixing my mistakes from last week because my batteries were not charged enough. But hello! Before I do that though, I just wanted to show off the project I'm working on. I'm working on a corset and it's looking really good. I have uh, three of the channels sewn on right now uh, for the, uh, the boning. <laughs> of it, but um, I need to reverse this one. I have it in the wrong direction, but we'll ignore that. That's why it's bulging out like that. But it is an interesting project and I'm really, really happy with it so far. It looks really good. Like, ah. I, I've never made a corset before. This is a new one for me. And so uh, this is my test of the pattern because I'm going to be cosplaying Daisy from High Rollers. Uh, which is a new fandom for me to cosplay from, but I love her design. I think it's really cool. And so I'm uh, testing it out with fabric that I've had in my stash for ages. Uh, this is the, the pattern that I'm doing, but what I'm doing is I'm taking this, oop, hello light. Uh, I'm taking this and I have swapped out the back panels of this one and C because I need the straps but I also need the lacing to be in the front. So as always, I'm never doing a pattern exactly as it's written. I'm always modifying it. At least this one, I'm modifying it with stuff that's already in the pattern. Does that make it easier? But yeah, I'm, I'm very happy with it so far. Uh, yeah, that's all. So uh, with, without further ado, I guess, I'm gonna find out where I last saved. <laughs> Because I don't know. Also, please excuse the shitty nail polish. I just got obsessive and started tearing off bits. As I do. I just like listening to this. So I was at the 30 hour, nine minute mark. Cool. I'm trying to figure out where I was. Had I, uh, had I gotten the uh, uh, swim? No, I still had all of these items here. So this is probably the beginning of my first time going through. It looks like I'm at the beginning of the park. I think that this was my first time going through because remember I got rid of a bunch of shit from my, uh, from my pack. So I'm curious, yeah, because see I have the X accuracy and stuff and I couldn't toss it or something. Uh, so I, ha I have not sold things yet now. Um, so this is my first time going through the park. Hello, no worries. Uh, I play Pokemon uh, every, almost every week. But thank you for the follow and all that jazz. So, okay, I think I know where I am. Last week for context, if you're still uh, watching, uh, I my batteries died, so, okay. So in this case, let's see. Trainer tips, press the start button to check remaining time, yes, yes. I think that I might, because I know where the thing is now, um, I'm going to just go ahead and catch a bunch of Pokemon. I mean, last week did happen. It's going to go up on my YouTube channel, but still. <laughs> I'm just going to go ahead and catch Pokemon to start. I might as well. Bye, Benanette. Oh yeah, another good way to tell would be looking at my poke. No, no, my Pokedex. Let's 
let's see. Have I seen the execute yet? Let's see. Execute. I don't know how to spell it. Uh, execute Pokemon number is number 102. Okay, so let's see. 102. Have I seen an execute yet? Because that'll answer a lot of questions. Okay, uh, I have. So I might already have the item that I needed. I genuinely don't know. We'll find out. It just looks like a pig. With that snub nose, Nidorina looks like a pig. I mean, I might as well try. Eh. I throw a rock at you, sir. Or ma'am. You're a female. Okay. What does this say? Yeah, I'm at the very beginning of the uh, safari here. Oh, okay. Hello, Nidorino. I throw a rock at you. I might as well try. There we go. But I do still need to catch the the uh, male Nidoran as well. Because I haven't done that. An aggressive Pokemon that is quick to attack. The horn on his head secretes powerful venom. Cool. No, I don't. I accidentally clicked it. I throw a rock at you. It was coming out. I like the Pokemon version of I bite my thumb at you. You're not wrong. <laughs> I throw a rock at you, sir. <laughs> do you throw a rock at me? Why, yes, I do throw a rock at you. <laughs> hey, I want to catch you. I'm just keeping an eye on the dogs in the kitchen. They're just sniffing the carpet and I have concerns but I did take them on a walk before this <laughs> Dahlia is rubbing her back on the underside of one of the chairs ah uh, bye bye horn okay I'm just gonna keep going cause why not Cute. Aww, Margo. Don't run. Haha. -ha. Boo. Rude. I throw another rock at you. I find it amusing that I'm throwing a rock at a rock. I also find it interesting that the rocks make it easier to catch them, allegedly. Why wouldn't the food make them easier to catch because they're distracted? It's probably going to escape from me now. No, huh. Rhyhorn, let me catch you, fucker. Okay. Hello, Execute. I mean, the rocks are free. I might as well throw them. Yep, there we go. Is this the same execute? Yep. 
It's the same level. I'm gonna say it's the same execute. It ran three feet. <laughs> Okay, I already have you, buddy. I don't need you. Hey. Buddy. I don't need you. Goodbye. I might as well get items. Okay. You know what? I don't I don't care about using up my time in here. I'm just gonna go ahead and collect things and then I will store them. I know that I'm wasting my steps here, but whatever. It's not like I can grab the, Jesus Christ. Yeah, see, there you go. Okay, so I'll just go ahead and catch Pokemon now. And then I will sell items and get rid of them. I think I know the route roughly. I think I still remember the route to the secret area. I still have 20 safari balls left. I might as well try to use them, you know? By the way, fun fact, I was looking up glitches in Pokemon uh, the other day, and one of the glitches is a uh, safari glitch where, uh, I forget how it works, but uh, I'd have to look it up, but you can use um, some glitch that makes it so that the Safari Pokemon, like the Safari Zone exclusive Pokemon, are available outside of Safari Zone. Um, I would need to look up how that works, but I think that's really cool that they have that as an option. Like, not on purpose, but you know. Astro? A rock at you, sir. Now, let me catch you. God damn it. Fine. I'll throw some bait at you, then. This feels very... Not to be a little punny. Bait and switchy. <laughs> I'm like, I'll throw a rock at you, and now I'll throw some bait at you. Rock bait, rock bait. Hey, just pretend the glitch was you tearing down the walls and freeing the captive Pokemon and then catching them again. <laughs> I got it, yay. Often mistaken for eggs, when disturbed, they quickly gather and attack in swarms. No, I do not. <laughs> I do, I refuse to give nicknames to Pokemon. And I'm going to save the game. Yes, I would like to save the game. That sounds like a great idea. <laughs> You're free, but not you, or you, or you. <laughs> I already have this one. Right. Oh, hello, Go Duo. I'm gonna start with bait. Stay here. Now I throw rocks. God damn it. Rude. Why would you run away from me when I'm throwing rocks at you? That seems so illogical to me. <laughs> Oh, 
Like, this mechanic and uh, the mechanic of, and just the whole thing of uh, the gambling area, genuinely, like, classic 90s, it makes no sense. And also the, the creepy guys at Erica's gym. Everyone knows you get closer to ranged attackers to give them disadvantage. <laughs> Let me catch you. Huzzah. Stiffens its ears to sense danger. Interesting. The larger its horns, the more powerful its secreted venom. Cool story, bro. No nicknames for you. <laughs> Hi, Rosie. <laughs> Rosie's just staring at me from the kitchen now. Let's see, what do I got? Oh, I still have plenty of steps left. Yep, Nidoran said size does matter, indeed. I have you. Hmm, I think I'll, well, no, because the Doduo is here, so I might as well try for it. All of the things I have are showing. Okay, I'm gonna walk back and if I get stopped, I will get stopped. I don't need you. I need the female one. Run. Okay. Going back to the main area. Oh, that was silly. Oh, you know what? I might as well fish. Item. Da, da, da. Good rod. Use. I think there are two Pokemon I can catch with this. I forget. Huzzah! Figured. I don't like that I have to go all the way back down again to get this. Rude. Goldine and Poliwag. That's the two. Hey. Whatever. Rude. You don't want me to throw rocks at you? That's so rude of you. Forgetting the prices of the Ultra Ball and the uh, the Great Ball, but honestly, the the price of those versus the 500 monies, whatever the money system is that I used here, totally worth it. 
Even if some of these Pokemon are available outside of the Safari Zone, in my opinion, anyway. Come on. There you go. Oh, so long as they're having fun. <laughs> 600 for a great ball. Yeah, exactly. Like, totally worth it. I've caught, what, three Pokemon? It would have been six from last week, but, you know, whatever. Absolutely worth it. Especially when you lose balls, like the regular Pokeballs on Pokemon. Like, yeah, I'm, I'm losing the Safari Balls, but it doesn't matter. Because they're all counted. I just got the mobile notification that you're live. Step it up, Twitch. Way to go, Twitch. Good job. So rude of it. I'm gonna try one more time and then I'm gonna go back to like trying for other Pokemon. Okay. Cause I still have steps left, I might as well. Oh, hello there, Scyther. Isn't it like a 5% chance of getting Scyther? Bait. Like, in the Safari Zone. I think that it's the one that's harder to find. Does bait and throwing a rock negate each other? I feel like that does. Ow, boo. Oh, well. But I saw it. That was cool. Oh, hello there, Rhyhorn. Will you let me catch you this time? Nope. How many steps do I have left? 124. I'm doing fine. I like Parasect from the view that I have when I toss it out. I do not like this view of Parasect. It's creepy AF. I do not like it. It looks like it's about to attack me. Ooh. Puppies are puppying. Let me love you. Damn it. It's very fluffy. I want to give it a cuddle. You know what? It looks kind of like a squishmallow. Why won't you let me catch you? I have nine left. Let me get you. Hey. Hey. Lives in the shadows of tall trees where it eats insects, which I find very disturbing uh, because it is an insect. Uh, it is attracted by light at night. I gotta get a Squishmallow one of these days. Right? That looks so cute. Uh, it would not be safe here because doggos. I feel like if I got one, they would just destroy it. Like, we used to have a pillow that looked like Rocket's face uh, that our old uh, housemates got us. And the funniest thing about this is that uh, Rocket, the first time she saw it, thought that it was another dog and squared up <laughs> even though it was literally just like a pug head it was so freaking cute <laughs> and she was like i don't know probably four or five back then <laughs> one of them just blinked their head But yeah, it was super duper cute when that happened. Come on, Rhyhorn, let me get you. 
Let me do it. I have eight safari balls to catch you with. Let's see, will I run out of steps or Pokeballs first? I'm guessing Pokeballs. I do not need you. Run. I mean, I might as well just try the fireball. Oh, that was really close. You're gonna run? Definitely gonna run out of the safari balls first at this rate. Three left. Come on, Rhyhorn. I believe in you. God damn it. Two left. Go me. Oh, I skipped that part. Something something bones. It can easily knock a trailer flying. No, I don't. <laughs> I clicked A way too quickly. No. <laughs> Yay. I have a singular Pokeball left. Let's try catching a Pokemon one more time from the water. E. One ball wonder. <laughs> Let's just try it. Whatever. <laughs> Let me catch you, Goldeen! Damn it. Okay. Ding dong! You are out of safari balls. Yep. Your safari game is over. Yep. Did you get a good haul? Come again. I will just as soon as I sell all of my damn shit. Hello, Pokemans. Can I just wrap around? Oh, good. Yeah, genuinely not bad. Let's see, what can I sell? I never use that. I don't care about the X accuracies, honestly. Nah, okay. So I'm gonna go down to my PC and get rid of some things I can see today. Okay, <laughs> thank you. Okay, so I need Parasect to cut this. Thank you. Whew, that made my eyes water. I find it so fascinating that the gym and the Pokemon Center, first of all, thank you for them being side by side in this one, but I find it amusing that they're so far away from everything else over here. Like, why? Okay, I know that depositing is limited. I'm trying to think of things that I already have in there. Let's see. 
I, I, I don't know. I'm just guessing. The town must have some weird Pokemon related zoning laws. Exactly. Go, no room left. So now I'm just going to go through and be like, are you in there? Nope. Since I think it's so silly, it's just like the line items that you're maxed out on. You can have as many of them as you want in there. So if I had a hundred escape ropes, it would be the same as having one, which is just so silly. See, burn heels in there. Cool. Okay. Like, it's such a coding thing. Let's see, I already tried those. I tried the antidotes already, yeah. Okay. I think that I've... Yeah, okay. So, I've got that. Is there anything that I can use or sell that's in here? I feel like I can sell the nuggets, but if I want to do missing no on nuggets, I think that there's the only three. Um, let's see. We can digitize physical matter and living creatures, but we can only have a spreadsheet with 25 rows. Exactly. Like, it's very, very silly. I'm trying to remember what rare candies can do. I'm so bad at this. I cannot remember what anything does. Let's see. Uh, Pokemon power-ups. Oh, it increases Pokemon's level by one. Hey, I'll just use those. Thank you. Doop, doop, doop. See, I never remember what anything does. Like, Awakening, sure, whatever. These TMs and shit, don't remember that. But, uh... Yeah, other items. What do Ether and Max Ether do? I'm just gonna look through and use up some things. Let's see. Effect when you use from the bag, it restores. Oh, it restores power points. Oh, right. Isn't this the one that gave me like zero money? I'm not going to do that. I'll get the HP up. I really should use some of these TMs or sell them. I can't get rid of the coin case, which sucks. Like, come on. My dudes. Oh, I can sell another X accuracy. What does the elixir do? I'm just looking at what all of these effects are. And what's really funny is when you were originally playing in the 90s, you wouldn't know what they did until you used them. Let's see. Oh, no, no, wait. I already looked at that. Brains. I am not awake, clearly. Let's see. What else? Master Ball. I have a Master Ball? I didn't realize that. Okay. So now I'm going to use some items. So, who should I level up? Let's go ahead and... Well, actually, let me see where these Pokemon are in leveling up. Because if they're, like, relatively close, I'm not going to waste it. So, 17, 6, 36... 3,000... 4,000... 
I might just use it on Charmeleon. Yeah, Charmeleon Butterfree. Charmeleon Butterfree and Doug Trio. That's who I'll use it on. Can you imagine using that on a Pokemon that was like 10 points away from leveling up? That would have been so sad. Let's see. Mm, Doug Trio, you weak. 87. 88. Jeez, it only did it by one. Okay, I'm gonna just use it on Doug Trio both times, because whatever. Okay. So now I'm going to go back in here. Item management, y'all. Deposit. I think I can put three things in there, if I remember right. I think I took three out. Let's find out. Okay. So there we go. I've done the thing. Now I'm going to sell that uh, accuracy. And then I can go back in. What a funny thing to say. I'm going to sell that accuracy. Okay. going to save. I'm going to be better about saving today and then I'll just forget everything later. So let's see. Uh, Safari Zone. Hello. History. Let's see. I want to look at, okay, Generation 1. The Pokemon. Oh, that's interesting. They give flea rates. Oh, but that's fire red and stuff. I have on generation one. Oh, okay. So whenever bait is thrown, the angry counter is reset. While the eating counter increases by a random value of between one and five. The opposite occurs if a rock is thrown, the eating counter is reset and the angry counter reset, uh, increases on the same basis. The catch rate is doubled whenever a rock is thrown, but halved whenever bait is thrown. Okay. At the end of each turn, it might uh, be decreased, it might run away, blah, blah, blah. Okay. What I want is my lovely uh, Generation 1 Pokemon potentials. Okay, I cannot get female Nidoran in the center area in red. I can get Nidorina. Uh, I've already gotten the Nidorino and Nidoran male. I don't need Parasect. I've got Venonat and Execute. I've got Rhyhorn now. Oh, there's a 1% chance of finding Chansey and a 4% chance of finding Scyther. Okay. When Fishing, Good Rod, Poliwag, Goldeen. Yep. Area 1 is where the female Nidoran is, 5% rate. Uh, 
Grass Parasect, Doduo is 15%. I'm just fascinated looking at these numbers. Kangaskhan is a 4%, Scyther is a 1%. And same, Poliwag Goldeen. Area 2 is where Nidorina is. Da 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 da. Chansey, 4%. Tauros, okay. Tauros, however you pronounce it. I'm just looking at all of the details here. Oh, I need to get a super rod. Okay, so I'm gonna write down the Pokemon that I still need to get. Um, okay, so I need Poliwag, Goldeen, Tauros. Sadly, no pincer, that's in yellow only. I think I have a Chansey. Do I have a Chansey? Hang on, let me look at my Pokedex. Chansey, what number are you? 113, okay. I like to believe the Pokemon are a 1% chance of being found, but actually they're all in a 1%er biker gang together. I love it. So 113. I believe I have a Chansey already. So I won't waste my time with that, if that's the case. Oh, I don't. Okay, so Chansey, Do Duo. Okay, what else is there? Oh, Scyther. Uh, how do you spell that with a C? Scythe, Scyther. Oh, a uh, female Nidoran. Arena. What else? Because I don't want to double up on Pokemon and waste these uh, balls. Uh, Venonat and Venomoth, I don't have either, I believe. What are their numbers? Oh, no, wait. Venonat I got. It's Venomoth that I don't have. Yeah, I just got a Venonat. But I might as well, like, level up the Venonat to Venomoth. Um, Kangaskhan. I caught one and then it died. Kangaskhan. Let's see. What else is there? Nope, that's Generation 3. Okay, so that's it. Um, with the rod that I have for fishing purposes. Okay, so now, now that I've written all of those down. Oh, I wanted to press B. Go away. Okay. Now I can go back in. Oop, went too far. Thank you. Yes. Okay, so I'm doing my best to remember the route now. I think I know it. And I might as well maybe catch Pokemon at the same time. Don't need you. I will go ahead and get this. Sweet. I am not wasting steps. <laughs> or trying not to anyway. Sweet. 
see, I have you already. Run. I feel like I need one of those, um, oh shoot. I'm gonna look at the map. I don't wanna waste my steps. I feel like I need one of those, um, what's it called? Uh, the, uh, I need a Pokedex, like, physically, so that I can mark down everything that I have. So let's see, I'm here now. I know, I wasted a couple steps. <laughs> Hey! Let me catch you, Nidorina. Hey! Poison pin. The female's horn develops slowly, prefers physical attacks such as clawing and biting. Okay. No nickname. And I'm just gonna save right there. <laughs> if I remember right, I have to go this way yes is it up yeah I just have to go straight up and around okay I've got it I'm proud of myself I mostly remembered this I don't need you Paris thank you though it's cute that you like me getting all of these items as I go. I, I will take that and that and that. Thank you very much. Yes, I caught it already. See, and the other effect of uh, my batteries dying last time is that I just do not remember what I actually caught. <laughs> uh, from this time versus that time do not remember Ooh. gotta get you right the fucking gold teeth so creepy give me surf yep i will save immediately after this <laughs> Yes, yes, yes. Well, maybe if you didn't have so many steps involved, it would be okay. Thank you. I've been here for 84 years. Ugh. Let's try catching the two Pokemans. Give me my water types. Okay, so I still need Poliwag. Its tail fin billows like an elegant ballroom dress, giving it the nickname of the Water Queen. <laughs> Fish and chips for dinner, oh no. <laughs> oh lord. You know what I think would be a really cool cosplay for Go Goldeen is like a rockabilly dress. I think it would be really fun.
Give me polywag. Thank you. Now it's a matter of catching it. Polywag. Come on. Really? I move down five feet. Do I catch something? Nope. I'll try one more time and then I'll move. <laughs> no point in doing this forever. Nope. Okay. Let's go back to catching Pokemon. Let's try right here. You cold team. Oh, run away. I'll try one more time. Okay. That's the male one. I don't need that one. Run. Come on. <sighs> I already have you too. I'm gonna try the rod again. I only have 50 more feet to walk. I'm just gonna update this, copy, paste, copy, paste, ugh, come on. Who else? Female Nidoran and Kangaskhan. Of course, I misspelled it, but you know what, whatever. There we go. How dare you get coffee? Its newly grown legs prevent it from running and appears to prefer swimming than trying to stand. No. There we go. 
Well, I don't need to uh, fish anymore. And I doubt that I will get any more. I'll get you one too, don't worry. Well, I might as well try to get the venom off because I have the Pokeballs. Oh, well. Bye, Venomoth. Why am I attracting all these Pokemon that I don't want? I have seven steps left. Beep boop. Time's up. Your safari game is over. Yep, I did. I'm going to save now. Sorry, let me just check one thing. Cool, cool, cool. That's the, uh... The bachelor party that I'm going to DM for, <laughs> which is a brand new experience for me. Let's do it. Thank you. Okay. So Taros, Chansey, Doduo, Scyther, Female Nidoran, and Kangaskhan. <laughs> Guys, we went to an awesome strip club in D&D, right? Uh, no, it's going to be a classic dungeon delve. So uh, there's it's going to be a dungeon and fighting and finding some magical items. <laughs> I am intrigued and looking forward to it. Please do not run away, Scyther. Thank you. Let me catch you. Yes! Vindication! Mantis. With ninja-like agility and speed, it can create the illusion that there's more than one. No, I will not. I am saving this. Save. <laughs> yes. Okay. I am grateful for my organization of typing the Pokemon into the chat that I need to catch. Because otherwise I'd be like, what do I need again? Welcome to the Goblin's Garters. Two drink minimum, please respect the dancers. <laughs> I was very explicitly clear, I am not that kind of dungeon master. <laughs> Sounds like it'll be fun. Uh, the the groom is very into D and D, and his friends are uh, D and D curious. <laughs> uh, so I'm going to uh, do a do a little bit of like classic stuff for them, uh, so they get they get the true vibe of the of the game. I don't need you. Stop following me around. Yeah, it should be fun. The only thing I'm not looking forward to is being awake for it because it's at 4 a.m. my time, but I was not about to say no to this game. wandering around at this point.
I've already caught two Pokemon, so I'm pretty happy. Hey! Hi, Doduo! Can I please catch you again? I would really appreciate it. Oh, I've only caught one so far, because I've only used one, uh, one, uh, Safari Ball. Anyway. I caught one that was very hard to catch, though. Although I'm 100% gonna put Goblin's Garters in a campaign at some point now for a laugh. I love it. Do it. Parasect, I don't want you. I have one already. Sorry, Paras, not Parasect, but you know what I mean. I have a Parasect. Yeah, and this morning I started working on my, uh, uh, planning for the games that I'm running in two weeks um, because uh, let's see my current players would definitely go right in and they're mostly women I mean yeah um, so in two weeks I'm running <laughs> a game on Friday and then a game on Saturday so on uh, Friday the 15th on EU happy hour I uh, on Horde of Tales for context because it's moved over to Horde of Tales. Um, I am going to be running a essentially a continuation of the Candela Obscura one shot that I ran um, for a charity stream in the summer. So it's uh, uh, going to be uh, figuring out because I left it on a cliffhanger. Uh, so figuring out what is causing all of the bleed to crop up in New Fair, uh, because it isn't just one painting. Uh, so that's that one. And then uh, the other game, I'm going to be running a Serenity uh, game, a Serenity one-shot on Live from the Apocalypse on Saturday the 16th. Uh, and I'm waiting for that cast to be revealed. I don't know... Uh, who my cast's gonna be yet, but I'm very, very stoked about it. Okay, I'm gonna throw a rock at this thing. It's not wanting me to catch it. And it ran. Oh, it was worth a try. But yeah, I'm excited for that. It'll be really fun. I don't need you. Go away. Are you gonna let me catch you this time, Dodo? Hmm? Hey! I got it! Okay, let's see. What do I have left to catch? Let's see. Twin bird! A bird that makes up for its poor flying with its fast foot speed. Leaves giant footprints. That's right, it does. No, I do not. Ugh. Come on. Where's my list? There it is. Copy. Because it's being weird. Paste. I don't need Dodua anymore, and I don't need Scyther anymore. There we go. I'm gonna move to a different section. I have no idea how many steps I have left. Okay, I have plenty of steps left. Don't need you execute. Ren. Well, let's try here. No. 
running. Like, I'm not doing too shabby. I'm pretty happy with this overall. But like, come on, my dudes. I don't, I don't need you. What I do need is to uh, pull up a water type Pokemon so I can put swim on them so I can get that item. <laughs> Already have you. Yes. There's only four Pokemon that I do not have that are here now. At least with the fishing rod that I have. If I get a better fishing rod and come back, then I can catch some other Pokemon that are in here. even throw a rock at you, sir. I just run away. You aren't even worth a rock being thrown at you. <laughs> like, the Pokemon that I still need in here are such a uh, low likelihood of even encountering. So, it's one of those mm, is it really gonna be worth it to try to come back until I have a better rod. Then I can try. I, I'm really sad though because, yeah, see, I caught the Kangaskhan before my battery died last week and then that failed. So, yeah. I'm gonna stop for now uh, with, the, with Safari Zone. Uh, at this point, there's no way I'm gonna catch anymore. <laughs> At least not for it to be worth my time. So. Pour one out for the Lost Kangaskhan. Exactly. I'm very sad about that. Genuinely. It would have been nice to have, but <sighs> not the end of the world. Okay. Now I think it's time to heal up. I'm gonna see which Pokemon are at this gym. If I remember correctly, they're all the way up to level 40. Let's see, Fuchsia City Pokemon Gym, Leader Koga, the Poisonous Ninja Master, okay. I'm probably gonna do some more healing, but whatever. Okay, so. I don't need a Pokemon Go guy. Whatever. Um, so, Ghost is. That's so weird. Uh, so, this is the Pokemon Go stri uh, type strengths and weaknesses. Under Ghost, it says that they're strong against Ghost and Psychic, but they're weak against Dark and Ghost. That makes no sense. I just saw that, I was like, mm. Okay, so ground and psychic is the way to go. Oh, but there are psychic Pokemon in here too. So, ground, bug, psychic, dark, ghost. Okay. Okay, not item, Pokemon. So, Butterfree is Bug and Flying, Dugtrio is Just Ground, which is a good one to have, 
for against uh, poison. Yeah. Oh, good. Poison and psychic are side by side. There we go. Fighting is bad. <laughs> I feel like Snorlax would be fighting. Normal. Okay. Bug and grass, which is uh, good and bad. Yeah, bad for poisoned. Good for psychic. Okay. Charmeleon is neutral, but Charmeleon is honestly low level at this point. I'm gonna move Charmeleon up here. I'm gonna just give it a try with these guys. You know what? Whatever. Have I been in here? Yes. Oh, yeah, I'll do that first. I have the gold teeth. Before I go and do that, let's just go talk to the guy. I think it was this one? Yeah. No, okay. Not this one, it's the other one. Let me, let me give you your teeth back. There you go. The warden popped in his teeth. <laughs> Thanks, kid. No one could understand a word that I said. I couldn't work that way. Let me give you something for your trouble. Yay. I'm assuming that this is a, a moving thing. Strength! Sure. That's what I thought. Snorlax can get it. Snorlax has an extra spot. So hey, let's use it. There you go. Yay! Yay! <laughs> Might as well use it on Charmeleon. Ooh! Slash. What do I have right now? Power! Ooh, I'm gonna get rid of Growl. I don't use that. I don't care. Yay! Hang on. curious to see when Charizard happens and it's level 36. Okay. I'm just gonna save that there. Okay. Whoop. Now, let's go fight some people. I like this town's music. Ba -da -ba -da -ba. Fuchsia City Pokemon Gym. Leader Koga. Winning trainers, of course, Gremlin. Because Gremlin's always one step ahead. Yo, champ and mating. Making. Mating? Uh, Fuchsia Gym is riddled with invisible walls. Koga might appear close, but he's blocked off. You have to find gaps in the walls to reach him. Okay. Cool story, bro. Since I don't know where the walls are. Actually, I think I see them. Maybe. I see the little... Little hash marks. I didn't read the first part of this. Beat my special techniques. Something or other. Oh, hello there, you... <laughs> Juggler wants to fight? My first thought was, you look like a cosplayer. Not even joking. 
<laughs> oh, hello, Drowsy. Can I burninate you? Burninating the countryside? Burninating all the people? That is such an old reference. Ooh, that's bad. Also, I didn't reclaim my items. I'll do that before uh, fighting the next person. <laughs> Weird. What are you doing? What is that move? Burninating all the peasants, burninating all the peoples. <laughs> That's all I remember of the song. <laughs> In the Thatcher Cottages, Thatcher Cottages. <laughs> No, I'm gonna keep using Charmeleon. And then Trogdor comes in the night. Yeah, it's been such a long time since I watched that, and it was like my sister's thing that I latched, latched onto because it was my sister's thing and I wanted to do it uh, and know all of the things. And then uh, I get obsessive about things, and so I watched every single thing. I found every single tiny little clue and stuff like that on that website. It was kind of ridiculous. Oh, come on, Kadabra. I would have used Slash in that case. Ugh. Slash. Homestar Runner is absolutely top tier internet. Oh, boo on you, Kadabra. Okay, I'm just gonna keep using Slash in that case. Since Charmeleon is hurt by the poison. Don't like you, Kadabra. There we go. You had me fooled. Yes, I did. I like poison and sleep techniques as they linger after battle. Wow, you're a weirdo. Okay. That's some um, serial killer behavior right there. No soon, okay. I'm going to get my items again. <laughs> oh, like the antidotes and stuff like that. Probably a good idea to get. <laughs> Just maybe. No, withdraw. There's not going to be any burning going on. There might be some sleepy times. Don't need that, don't need that. Don't need any of that. I won't need the elixir because I can always just pop back over. Possibly. And this is one of those things I might as well just get all of them because it's not like they take up any more space. One versus 14. What else is left? Potion, Hyper Potion, Revive, Full Heal, Max Revive. I wonder if Revive brings it back to one and Max Revive brings it up all the way or something like that. Don't know. You know what? I might as well just grab it. I don't use those things very often. Might as well test it out. That's good enough. Bye! I think revive is half HP and max is full. Okay. 
That makes sense. I was thinking of it in D&D terms. <laughs> I must admit. Okay, so I'm going off of my theory that, yeah, yep, those are absolutely walls. I can see the invisible walls when I'm seeing it on there. On this, it would be more difficult to see the walls, but they're lines, they're vertical lines. So I can see them. Strength isn't the key for Pokemon, it's strategy. I mean, it's both. Uh, I'll show you how strategy can beat brute strength. Okay. Another juggler. With one Pokemon. Got Hex. Okay, hi Hypno. I don't like your intro music. I do not. Also, Charmeleon's not going to be able to fight this guy. Most likely. I might as well just do one attack though. Critical hit? Oh, buddy. Eh, I might as well try with Charmeleon, maybe. Until he faints. Yeah. Bye, Charmeleon. Okay, that was like a level 38 or something. I like that he said no brute strength, and then his hypno is headbutting me. I just want to point that out. Um, let's see. This is psychic, which means bug, dark, and ghost are its weaknesses. So, parasect. I think it counts as a bug, or is it grass type? Whatever. Spore. Rude. Very rude. I'm glad this is a 100% successful thing. Oh no, he's an idiot. Someone was like, remember son, use your head, not just might. And he was like, headbutt's got it. Let's leech your life. Thank you. Thank goodness for that, uh, move. Spore is perfection. Thank you. Sweet. What? Extraordinary. Okay. So you mix brawn with brains? Good strategy. Okay, the kid was right. Strategy beats strength. Yup. And I'm just gonna go ahead and heal them again because it's literally right here. Like, why waste items that cost money when you can just do this? Like, I'm sure if this was even a nominal fee, like 10 money to do maybe then i would be less willing to go to the uh pokemon centers but it's right there and it costs nothing to pop over and back yeah see so all of this is blocked off i was ready to fumble my way through but i don't need to i'm gonna switch out chameleon I don't know what the next one is, so I'm just going to go ahead and put Parasect in the front. Hi, buddy. I wanted to become a ninja, so I joined this gym. I don't think that has anything to do with joining this gym. You're, you're a juggler. You're not a ninja. Okay. Hi, Drowsy. I'm going to make you go to sleep so I can beat you. Like, it's weird, but Parasect has become my favorite Pokemon this go-around. Oh, come on. Fine, I'll just make them all go to sleep. That's fine. <laughs> like, seriously.
Oh, boo. It's okay. I'm gonna make you go to sleep for a very long time. Nope. Because I hate drowsy. And are you asleep one? Yeah. Keep, keep sleeping. You're fine. Just keep doing your thing. scratch him. I love this. Like, yes, please. Make my life so much easier. Hey! Level up! Okay. You know what? Honestly, no. I'm just gonna keep using Parasect. Four. Oh, come on. Wow, Parasect has 101 health now. Oh, let me use my spore. Good. Leech leg. Oh, come on. Well, that's fine. I'm gonna leech its life anyway. Hey. Everyone falls asleep. Go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I did not know how Spore worked when I first played the game. Like, you know, I have all of those TMs that I have not used. Like, this is the thing. you. Holy shit. Let's just get back up to full health and then just keep going. <laughs> dun dun dun. Sweet. I'm done for. Yeah you are. I will keep on training under Koga, my ninja master. Okay, you do that while I save my game. I did not need to click on that again. Whoops. Okay, so looking at this, there's nothing there. So next I'm coming up here. Hi, buddy. I also study the ways of the ninja with Master Koga. Ninja have a long history of using animals. What? I feel like there needs to be a little bit more to that sentence. Just a little bit. Just a smidge. Tamer. Okay, so you mean abusing animals. Ooh. Hi, Arbok. I don't like you. Mm -mm. Go to sleep. Ow. Genuinely, strategy-wise, why would I do literally anything else than start with Spore? Thank you for keeping on sleeping, Arbok. I appreciate you. <laughs> Teeny tiny scratch. That's fine. I'm gonna make you pass out again right here. So. <laughs> you level up yet? Sand slash. Eh. 
Yeah, sure. I'll switch Pokemon. What is Sandslash? Sandslash is... Uh, no, 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 no. Ground type. What are ground types weak against? Grass, ice, and water. Well, I don't have any water Pokemon on me anyway. And strong against electric fire. Well, electric is a given. Fire, poison, rock, steel. Okay. I don't have any of those, so I'm just going to use Doug Trio. Take it. Aw, okay. Not a big deal. Just for funsies. Ah. Uh... Ow. Jesus. I'll slash you right back. Rude. Yes, because he's 35 HP left. I'm gonna do... You know what? Just because I'm curious, I'm gonna put Snorlax out. I have plenty of Pokemon, so no big deal. Let's use Strength and see what happens. Oops. What does Amnesia do? I don't know what these things do because I haven't fought with Snorlax, really. Oh, okay. Let's headbutt you. He. Ow! Okay, Tamer. I don't think you have anything to do with being a ninja. I still have much to learn. Yeah, like how to be a ninja. I, I don't see that. <laughs> you are a lion tamer equivalent. That has nothing to do with being a ninja. Thank you. The one thing that I hate about, um, yuck. The one thing I hate about having, uh, made a Kickstarter is how much spam bullshit there is. Like, there's so many bots that are just looking for the word Kickstarter, uh, or crowdfunding, or things like that. And it is so annoying on Twitter. Like, I was getting emails for a while, too, and I'm just like, but why? I am going to save this. Just seeing if there's any other news happening on my emails. Okay, so I've done all that. Okay, I see that there. Okay, so I have to do those two guys over there before I get to it. This is, I can see it, but it's hard to see. Eh, I'll keep Parasect out for that one. 
stop right there. Our invisible walls have you frustrated? No, they don't. I can see them. It's fine. Another tamer. What's in his other hand? That looks like a frying pan. Does he have a frying pan in his other hand? Is he learning from Eugene? And, and, uh... Oh, what's her name? Rapunzel. My brain just went there. I don't need it, but... Might be a good time to switch Pokemon. Yeah, that's not fun. I'm going to switch to... Sure, Butterfree. Why not? I do not remember what level Sand Slash is, but I feel like it's like a 33 or something. Confusion! That's fine. Psybeam. <laughs> Arbok. Yes, I think I'll switch to Doug Trio and use. Dig, or maybe Earthquake. I'll start with Dig. Ha! Nice. Whoa, he's got it. She, but yeah. You impressed me. Here's a hint. Look very closely for gaps in the invisible walls. That is not helpful. Okay, let's see. Uh, now keep Parasectum 4. Master Koga comes from a long line of ninjas. What did you descend from? Juice? <laughs> Juggler wants to fight. Juggler, find out, send out Drowsy. Cool. Drowsy, I'm going to put you to sleep. Thank you. I feel like Spore should be like 90% effective or something like that. Like make it a little bit more difficult. Or more likely to wake up. Something like that. Like it's too effective. Yeah, there you go. Oh, okay. That's fine. Exactly, it's super OP at 100%. At least, like, I only have uh, 15 of them, but still. If I'm able to just pop over to heal up, then it doesn't matter. That's fine. Both of your Pokemon are asleep, my dude. Oh, this one isn't. Oh. I thought it was. Whatever. Done. <laughs> that was dumb. Hey! Level up! You know what? Yes, because Hypno is asleep, I will change out Pokemon. 
Let's do Snorlax. I do find it funny that Hypno is fast asleep after being, like, body slammed, basically. And headbutt. Just sleeping right through it. Like you do. There we go. Sweet. Dropped my... <laughs> I know he's a juggler. Drop my balls. <laughs> the translators had to know. They had to know. Like, come on. Where there is light, there is shadow. Light and shadow. Which do you choose? Yeah, I'm gonna... I know that they don't need to heal. Eh not going to. You know what? I'm going to save right here, and I'm going to just try to defeat this dude. Why not? They 100% knew. They absolutely had to know that that sounded super dirty. <laughs> A mere child like you dares to challenge me? Very well, I shall show you true terror as a ninja master. You shall- there's more. I thought that was it. That you shall fear the despair of poison and sleep techniques. <laughs> High-pitched voice. Judge my balls. <laughs> Koga wants to fight. Koga sent out coughing. Okay. Hi, coughing. Four. Interesting. Imagine if he just stabbed you with a dagger after that. The true terror of a ninja stab. Exactly. <laughs> that would be very, very funny. Eh. I don't need to leech life, but why not? rather than just using cut all the time. Oh, come on. That's silly. Okay, let me scratch you. <sighs> Adam coughing fainted. Yeah, that's right, he did. About to use muck. Poison type. Ground and psychic are the best. Okay, yes. And Doug Trio. Doug Trio. Oh, I am one level up. Let's dig. <laughs> Oh, boo. Hey. I will take that. Nice. That was so slow mo moving, too. It just went... Ooh. That's just fascinating to me. Coughing. Eh, I'll keep Doug Trio out. Can Earthquake work on coughing? I always forget. I'm gonna try it. Seems to work. Sweet. Bye-bye, coughing. Oh, aw. Okay, and I think the wheezing is the highest level, question mark? Nope. Dugtrio is my highest, so I'm gonna keep using him. 
Mmm, 43, right, right, right. Dig. Oh, I'm glad I dug. Hello there. <laughs> Great. I didn't do anything. That was wonderful. <laughs> I defeated Kuga! Humph, you have proven your worth. Here, take the soul badge. And a lot of money. Now that you have the soul badge, the defense of your Pokemon increases. It also lets you surf outside of battle. Oh good, I needed that. Ah, take this too. Make space for this child. Yeah, well, fuck you. Uh, <laughs> uh, is there an item that I can use? Sure, I can use this. I forget what it does. I'm going to use it on... Pidgeotto because I need a thing. Okay, speed. Cool. You already told me all this. Yay! I got another item. Toxic. It is a secret technique over 400 years old. Being toxic, I think that it's far older than that. I pretend that I'm funny. Cool. Well, let's get out of here. I got another badge. Go me. I'm proud of myself. I do find it very funny that the only people have who have defeated these gym uh, masters are the two ten-year-olds. No one else has defeated them. Just ten-year-olds. Okay, so I'm gonna get Gyarados out and teach it surf so that I can then surf around. I love this idea. And I'll, well, see this is the problem with the HMs and everything because you need them all for different things and that makes it, it kind of shoehorns you into which Pokemon you can have on you. I don't know. Bill's PC. Deposit. Let's deposit Snorlax. I'm sorry, buddy. You know, if I need to use the strength thing, then I will at some point. Let's see. I think... Okay, I need to... I need to switch boxes. Yes, that's perfectly fine. Please, save it. Oh, jeez, there are three. I don't know which one it's in. Withdraw. Nope. Change box. Yes. Box one. Withdraw. Gyarados. Only level 24. Oof. Item. Nope. HM3, I believe, right? Yay! You know what? Can I teach strength to Gyarados as well? Ooh, I can. Yay! Okay, cool. I don't need you, Snorlax. Okay, where do I go from here? Let's find out. Okay, so... Oh no, I'm not in the Bulbapedia walkthrough. Hang on. Let's see. Mm 
There we go. So let's see. I just did this. I'm on part 11 of what, 16? Yeah, I'm on part 11 of 16, not doing too shabby. Okay, so I did Fishing Guru 2, Fuchsia Gym, Warden Safari Zone. Uh, there's a man across the pond next to the Rocket Game Corner. Use it on a chancy. Oh, okay, no, that has nothing to do with what I want. Okay, let's see. After exploring Fuchsia City, fly back to Lavender Town and head south on Route 12 and pass by Celadon to get a new item. Well, I don't have a, a Chansey, so... Let's see. But sure, I'll use fly. Lavender Town, right? Head south to Route 12. Okay. Ooh. I haven't been here yet. Otherwise known as Silence Bridge, Route 12 is a great spot for fishermen. Don't forget your poke flute because the second Snorlax is still snoozing away halfway through the route. Oh, okay. I don't think I have it. Maybe I do. I do not. Okay, so I'll go get that. <sighs> Bike. No creepy music. I need the poke flute. Withdraw the flute. Done more. Me too, Tela. Oh, I can't carry anything more. Fine. I'll deposit stuff. Oh, I can use the protein. Hang on. Item. I didn't see that. I will use it. I don't know. I don't remember what these things do, and I do not care. Uh, I'm gonna give it to Tremulian. Hey, Tremulian's attack rose. Do I have anything else that I can just straight up use? Nope. Ah! What just happened? That was weird. And which uh, Pokeballs do I have? I have the Great Balls on me. I might as well... Oh, and I have the Ultra Balls. I might as well use up all the Great Balls and then I'll just switch to using Ultra Balls. I think I have a bunch of regular Pokeballs too. Nope. Give me my bike. Creepy music be gone. Let's say Route 12, north to Lavender. Okay. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. There's a lookout spot upstairs. Okay, I'll take the lookout spot. Sure. My Pokemon's ashes are stored in Pokemon Tower. You can have this TM. I don't need it anymore. I don't have room. 
I really should, like, spend some time, like, mark down all of the TMs that I have and just put them on Pokemon. I think that's what I need to do. What are you? Skull Bash. Cool. Can I? It's one of those things of, is it worth it to use TMs on Pokemon because then they learn new things and maybe the things that they're learning is better? I don't know. Mm. You know what? I think it's time to look through items. I'm gonna grab a notebook. Hang on. Yeah, this still has a ton of pages. Cool. Okay. So I am going to go back to Lavender Town. I am going to look through all of the items. And see what numbers I have. But I might as well do it all at the same time. Okay, starting with what I have here. So I've got TM37. I'm going to put it down here, TM37, 8940, TM40, 32, yes I am giving myself space on this. I'm marking down the HMs over here as well. Do I have anything else? TM6. Okay. Now I'm gonna boot this up. Let's see what I have. Because honestly, I might just assign them to Pokemon just to clear them out because the likelihood of me actually like giving them to my Pokemon is very, very low. So let's see, TM28. Okay. And I will look up what they are afterward. TM44. Twenty-four. HM1. TM42. TM30. Oop, broke my pencil. Eleven. Twelve. HM5. TM forty five TM nineteen I have so many TMs TM twenty one TM seven It's amazing how many you collect. Eighteen. Twenty-nine. Thirteen. Thirty-six. Three. Forty. 
36. HM2. Okay, so that's all of them. And now I'm going to look up what they all are. So honestly, I'm just going to uh, save this so that I'm not wasting my battery. And then let's just switch over to my main screen. And I'm gonna look up these things because I wanna know what they are. So hang on one second, let me switch to full screen. Yeah, so there's full screen mode. Enjoy the game's music whenever it pops up. Uh, at this point, I have it turned off for myself uh, if it decides to show up. Uh, but yes, let's look at the full list of TMs. TMs and Pokemon Red, Blue, and Yellow. Okay, so six is Toxic. Seven is Horn Drill. Um, two, Razor Wind. Three is Swords Dance. Seven is Bubble Beam. Twelve Water Gun, thirteen Ice Beam. Um, eighteen Counter. Nineteen is Seismic Toss. One is Mega Drain. Then we have 24 Thunderbolt. Thunderbolts of Lightning. Very, very frightening. Sorry. <laughs> oh, we have a dig. A generic dig that's different than Dig Dig? I'm confused by that, but okay. Uh, 29 is just psychic. Okay, yes, I, I'm not surprised that it's a psychic ability if it is called psychic. 30 is teleport. 32 is double team. self-destruct. 42 is Dream Eater. Uh, three more. 44 is Rest. What does Rest do? Oh, I've had this since Saint, uh, the SS Anne. Uh, user sleeps for two turns, but then is fully healed. That is terrible. I don't like that. Okay, 45 is Thunder Wave. And 46 is Psy Wave. Which is a useful one. I like that one. Because, um... <laughs> I'm so sorry I was not looking at the chat until now. Thank you, Deep Squirrel, for... <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm rocking out of the chat. Anyway, okay, so I have so many things. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. I have 22 TMs. This is ridiculous. Uh, you know me, it doesn't take much. This is very, very true. Okay, so I need to get rid of 
some of these, whether I uh, give them to Pokemon or what. So I think that I'm just going to now switch back to the Pokemon screen and I'm just gonna like pull out Pokemon and just give them these abilities so that I'm, I have no patience for these TMs. You know me, but okay. So I'm gonna switch over again and let's, uh, let's do this. Just to get them out of the way because I've run out of space. And considering the fact that you know I do not care about this stuff, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna get it over with. So I'm going to drop off some Pokemon. Oh wait, I, I need to switch. Nope, nope, nope. That's not what I need. I need to change my box. I'm going to put them into box four. Get her done. Exactly. Yes. I'm going into box four so that I know the Pokemon I want are in box four. I'm just gonna deposit all of them. Cause I don't wanna give any of these abilities to any of my Pokemon that I have on me. Well, maybe I should check Pidgeotto actually. Let me see. Pokemon, Pidgeotto, stats. What do you have currently? I can get rid of Gust and maybe Whirlwind. Okay, so I'll I'll hang on to Pidgeotto still. No, Bill's PC. So, deposit. Okay, there we go. Okay, so now I'm going to switch over to the Pokemon that I got from the um, Safari Zone. So that would be box three, I believe. Let's see. I don't need to change box again. Let me withdraw. Okay, so let's see. Um... With these abilities, I think that, uh, Scyther, let's see. I'm just looking at the various ones that I have here. I'm just picking random ones at the moment, I feel. I'm trying to do like a, a mixture of types. I do need to have a water type. Okay, so I'll do Poliwag. Sure. It's level 10, but whatever. Let's see. Okay, so now items. Okay, what do we have? 37 is Egg Bomb. I highly doubt that anyone can use this. Nope. Okay. 40 is Skull Bash. Who can use Skull Bash? Cool. Rhyhorn's going to learn Skull Bash. Done. Okay. So I'm going to cross that one out. 32. Double team. Surely someone here can use this. All of them can. Amazing. Mm. What does double team do? 32. Uh, raises the user's evasiveness by one stage, making it more difficult to hit. Eh. I am not going to give that to uh, a Pokemon that I care about. <laughs> I'm going to be honest. I 
I am a very, uh, let's just, uh, do all of the attacks kind of, uh, <laughs> person. I doubt that I can use Toxic for any of these Pokemon. Let's see. Oh, they all can. Cool. Let's see what Toxic does. Six. Because if I find one that Pidgeotto can use, I will put it on. Toxic causes the target to be badly poisoned. Pokemon that are badly poisoned will lose an increasing amount of HP at the end of each turn. Okay. The affected Pokemon will lose 1 16th of its maximum HP. Oh, the more you know. At the end of the first turn, uh, which then increases by 1 16th each turn. In other words, 1 16th, 1 8th, 3 16ths, 1 4th, and so on. If used by a poison type Pokemon, Toxic will always hit, even if the target is invulnerable. In the invulnerable stage of Bounce, Dig, Dive, Fly, Phantom Force, Shadow Force, or Sky Drop. Okay, good to know. That's kind of cool. You know what? I'm going to give it to Nidorina because it makes sense. Uh, we'll see. Yes. Tail Whip is stupid. Go away, Tail Whip. And then if I ever use Nidorina, she has a useful thing. Okay, so that's all of the items that I can use that are here. So, okay, so Toxic is gone. Uh, resource management, I hate you. Okay, I'm going to deposit some stuff for now. Like, it gets to a point where there's so many things that you're not allowed to discard that you're very limited on what space you can have. I feel like there should be multiple boxes like there are with Bill's uh, PC. Oh, no, I did not want to store my bike. Give me my bike back. <laughs> I was distracted talking. I will, I will get the bike back. Okay, I'm just gonna deposit all of the things that I can. Okay. That's fine. Withdraw. I'm just getting all of these TMs and then I will go from there. Okay. Until I run out of space. Okay, I have maxed out. But then I can deposit more things and just walk around. This is very annoying. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Whatever. Push the wrong direction. That's okay. No room. Okay. Withdraw. This is very exciting, I'm sure. Oh, did I only have the one more? Okay, we'll find out. It's gonna be very funny if that's the case. Oh no, no, I still have more than that. I saw the old rod, not the good rod. Anyway.
Maybe I'll just sell the nuggets rather than, uh, like, I have so much money. It might not be worth it to duplicate them. Because I don't feel like I'm going to be needing it. Do I have any more? I do. TM13, come to me. Still more space. Okay, TM3 is after the card key. Ugh. Okay. I'm just gonna stop there. And now I'm going to... No, wait. Nope, nope, nope. I'm just going to go with what I have here. Okay, items. Let's see, where are the uh, water types? Okay, bubble beam, water gun, ice beam. Okay, that's 11, 12, and 13. Yes, I will go. Oh, need arena, interesting. Polywag. yay. Goodbye, bubble beam. Yay, water gun, go away. Okay. How many things does Polywag have? Cool. Yeah, I'm just gonna teach all of them the polywag then. Okay, 13. Do I have 13 here? I do. Yay, okay. Okay, how many abilities does Doduo have? So it's a normal and flying type. Oh, it already has a bunch of stuff, okay. I'm just gonna look at all of them now. Need Arena, okay. And Rhyhorn. Rhyhorn only has two things. Let's give Rhyhorn more things. Okay, what else can Rhyhorn have? Wait, what does he have already? Horn Attack and Skull Bash. I feel like Seismic Toss would be a good one. Uh, 19. I feel like it should be able to use it. Yes. Nope, okay. Um, what else? Maybe it can learn Dig 28. Maybe. Yeah. Yay. You know what, can it use self-destruct? So I'll give it self-destruct. 36. Nope. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, I don't think that there's anything else that it could use that's here. Maybe horn drill. Do I have seven here? Yes. Yeah, there you go. Okay. Cool. So I'm going to go ahead and deposit all of these Pokemon. <sighs> Except for Pidgeotto. And grand scheme of things, I'm on section, uh, what, uh, 12 of 16 of this game. Like, who knows how many more months I'm going to be playing this, uh, because I'm playing it on stream. Um, but also, I just don't care. <laughs> you know I'm not, like, an OP 
gamer or anything like that, like, Spore is the closest to OP that I get. Sure, I'll withdraw both of you. I don't know why there are only two in this box. So, change box. Yes, yes. Oh my god, you're not a real gamer girl? No, I don't give a flying rat's ass about stuff. Oh, let's see. Sure, I'll take out Lapras. Well, I don't know if there's anything else for a water type. Uh, do I have any electric types? Oh, duh, I have Pikachu, but Pikachu's pretty happy. I'll pull out Hitmonchan. Oh, maybe Cubone can do stuff. And I'll grab Ghastly. False, you are a real TTRPG gamer girl. Yeah, that's right. That's right I am. Okay, I can't take any more out. Okay. Okay. So, items. That's 44. Rest. Can anyone learn? All of them can learn rest. Perfect. Drowsy, you learn rest. Oh, okay. Drowsy already has shit. Let's see what you have. Drowsy has good moves. God damn it. No, I click B. No. Um, no, no. I want to abandon it for Drowsy, but I want to give it to someone else. Oh, this is so annoying. No, abandon learning rest, yes. Okay, let's try this again. Use. I will give it to, and eh, why not? Eh. Yeah, I'll give it to Lapras. There we go. Okay, rest is gone. Let's look at another one. What's 24? Thunderbolt. I doubt that any of the Pokemon here can use this. Yes. Oh, Lapras can? What? Sure. Lapras, learn Thunderbolt. Go for it. Be confusing as fuck. Okay. 42, Dream Eater. Can anyone learn Dream Eater? Nope. Okay, because Drowsy needs to switch. Okay, 30 is Teleport. Probably also just Psychic Pokemon. In which case I need to get like Abra or something. Yeah. Uh, 45 is Thunder Wave. Can you learn it, Lapras? No, but Drowsy's able to? Weird. Okay, nope, not doing that one. 19 is Seismic Toss. Yes, I would love to teach it to someone. Cool. Uh, Cubone. Learn Seismic Toss. Done. Oops, sorry. I am getting through these. Okay, I already looked at 25. 21 is Mega Drain. No idea. Nope. Okay. Two is Razor Wind. I feel like some, someone can use this. Yes. Sure, I'll give it to Pidgeotto. That sounds awesome. I'm gonna get rid of Gust. Yes. Goodbye, Gust. Sweet. Okay. 
18 is counter, which I believe mirrors it or something. I don't really care. Yay, Cubone, learn another thing. Cool. Am I getting rid of all of these TMs? Why, yes, yes I am. Go away, TMs. And honestly, even if I just like get rid of most of them, I'm happy. Okay, 21 is Mega Drain. I don't think anyone can use this. I think I already looked at that one, but I'm forgetting. Yeah, no. Okay, oop, nope. 29, Psychic. Probably not because it's just Drowsy. And Drowsy already is pretty well stocked in what I like. I mean, Lapras, can you learn it? Oh, okay, Lapras is out, but let's see what Lapras has already. Growl is useless. Go away, Growl. Lapras has the weirdest abilities now. I just want to point that out there. Okay, there we go. Go away, Psychic. Okay. Next, 36 is the last one, which is self-destruct. I doubt that anyone here can use this. I don't like it as an ability. Yeah, no. Okay. Cool. Getting there. Box one right now. Interesting. Okay. So I'm gonna, let's see. I still have teleport, self destruct, egg bomb, dream eater, thunder wave, psi wave, and mega drain and swords dance. So I'm going to grab some more Pokemon from box three. Nope, I didn't change boxes. I like that this is just saving my data for me though. Thank you. I'll take it. Okay, so withdraw, Scyther, Venonat, Execute. Let's see what Execute has so far. I need a Reno. Do I have any more space? I do. I've already got all of those. Sure, let's pull out Goldina as well and see what I can give her, if anything. Okay. Oh, wait. I need to grab more of the TMs. I think I have some left that aren't in my pocket right now. Withdraw. HM, HM. TM, yes. I wish it wouldn't pop me up back to the top again. HM, TM37, I think that might be the last of them. Yep, okay, cool, 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 cool. Okay, let's see if I can get rid of <laughs> the rest of these TMs. Okay, 42, Dream Eater, maybe, hmm? Nope. Cool. 30 is teleport. Sure. Execute. Learn teleport. Awesome. Go away, teleport.
Thunder wave. I doubt anyone can use thunder wave. Yep. Cool. Better not. Learn it. Mega dream. Go away. Thirty-six. Self-destruct. Oh, sure. Oh, okay. Probably nothing more then. Let's see what you have. Barrage, hypnosis, reflect. No, actually, those are pretty good. Yes, abandon learning, self-destruct. Okay. Even if I don't get rid of all of the TMs, the fact that I'm getting rid of so many, I'm pretty happy about. That's what I thought. There you go, Scyther. Sword Stance sounded like a Scyther ability. Let's see, where was I? 46 Psy Wave, right? Yeah, 36 I already looked at. Cool. Venonat, learn it. Last one. I, I'm sure that this is only Execute who can use it. I'm not going to deal with that right now. I got rid of most of them, though. So let's just go ahead and pop the remaining ones into my PC after grabbing my stuff. Um... Yes. Give me my bike. And I think that I learned a new thing about moving stuff around that makes it easier. I'm going to test that theory first. So, item, bike. I know. What are you. Is it start? No. Yeah. There we go. No, I wanted to move it. Oh, this takes forever. Okay, so I click and click again. There we go, okay. Cool. I'm gonna put the uh, town map there. Okay, so I'm learning new things. So withdraw. I want my town map. I know I need the poker flute. Nope. I'm going to get any Pokeballs that I have. Because I feel like I have the regular ones too, maybe, unless I, except for the Master Ball. Uh, unless I um, got rid of it. I don't remember. Repel, coin case. I'm saving all of those because I'm me. Hyper Potion, sure, there's only one of you, so I'll use you at one point to get rid of that line. I don't need Repel anymore. I should probably sell those. And then if I do need them again, I can just buy them again. I don't care about the lost money. Let's see. Eh, why not? Okay, I must have used all of the regular Pokeballs up then. Okay, good to know. Great ball. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Sure.
Ah, there's my town map. I'm almost done with this, and then I'm gonna stop for the day because I have more things to do. I hope you've enjoyed me, like, angrily <laughs> putting abilities on Pokemon because they've been taking up space. Okay, I'm going to just deposit things now. I think I've gotten enough of my stuff. Learn things so I can carry more stuff. Exactly. I don't need all of these TMs. Take them away from me. Okay, so no, I didn't want to deposit you. I wanted to move you. I have to go all the way to the bottom. But who knows, maybe there's something else that I wanted that I just didn't look at. Nope. <laughs> sure, I'll grab the awakening. I just don't use TMs. HMs, sure, but I don't really use the TMs. Okay. So now I'm going to move the town map. Select. No, I pressed the wrong button. Not A. I need to press select both times. Select. Select. There we go. Bike, town map, good rod. Yay! Okay. Oh, I need to change out my Pokemon, I believe. Deposit. Yep. Box three. Like, most of them are decently high levels. I'm pleasantly surprised. But yes, I do not uh, need those. So I'm going to withdraw all my buddies. And then I'll switch to box two. And I'll catch Pokemon into box two because it's empty. And I don't like that. But I'm not going to spend time rearranging my boxes. I don't know why it was like that. Okay. Change box. Yes. Box two. No, not box three. Box two. Dang it. <laughs> I am extra saving. Yes. Box two. Okay. There we go. I've got all of my Pokemans. I'm going to move Gyarados. Uh, see, now I have Surf and Strength. Uh, Gyarados should be in the front because it needs to level up a little bit. Um, and, well, now that I've done that, I need to save again. And all good. Yay! Done for today. With no battery death. So, um, let's see. Uh, I think that I'll be back maybe working on this on Tuesday. Who knows? I have a working light now uh, in my office, so I'm able to do more streams in the evening rather than all of the ring lights facing me. So uh, maybe that was the push that I needed to actually get back into sewing on stream. Uh, but I've just kind of been binging uh, Buffy and Angel while I sew, uh, which I can't really do on stream. Anyway, um...
um, yeah, so should anyone see this before the Kickstarter ends, uh, less than 24 hours until The Apothecary's Apprentice on Kickstarter is over, and I'm hoping gearing up for maybe us hitting that next stretch goal, the extended stretch goals uh, at 7,000 euros. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, but in any case, let me get Moobot to give you that command. Uh, apprentice. There you go. Uh, things and stuff. Very exciting. Yay. Uh, we'll see what happens. Uh, but until next time, I don't know if it's worth it to raid. I think that it's just you, uh, Deep Squirrel. Let's see. Yeah, we're not going to raid anywhere. But yes, uh, I will be back next time doing more Pokemans. Well, maybe doing cosplay streaming before that. But anyway, have a good one.